Okay, let's get a check of our forecast. Another uh, nice day, but I feel like it's warming up a bit. Yes, uh, your body temperature is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Going up a few degrees, and uh, we're going to get even into some hotter weather here as we head through the next couple of days. Also tracking that chance of some thunderstorms. So let's move it into that microclimate forecast. And uh, TGIF a little bit early. We're going to take it right into Friday morning. And look, no big changes on tomorrow morning's forecast. Temperature starting off with the cool side, upper 50. And low 60s, some patchy fog near the coast and the bay. That'll also put us here with 58 in the East Bay, San Francisco 57, and double fives there through the North Bay. Let me get you a better look at that fog, and you can see by about 9:30 tomorrow morning, we're holding on to some of it near the bay, also Oakland and San Francisco. But then through the afternoon, that all clears back, except for some of our beaches. So do expect plenty of sunshine. I think overall Friday's forecast is setting up pretty good for us. Numbers will go up another degree or two, but we're definitely not. Not going to be in the heat wave category tomorrow. 82 here in San Jose, not bad. 80 in Cupertino, probably got it the best there. 86 in Morgan Hill, right here through the East Bay. 77 in Hayward, 79 Fremont over those East Bay Hills. Hottest when you get uh, closer to the Central Valley, Antioch up to 92. The peninsula anywhere from 65 in Half Moon Bay to 80 in Palo Alto. San Francisco, a little bit of heat here in downtown in the Mission. And you head to the outer sunset, we'll be at 64. Breeze out of the west at 19. We'll make it somewhat enjoyable here through San Francisco. And the North Bay, 80 in Mill Valley, 85 Santa Rosa, and some warmer low 90s, Ukiah, and also Clear Lake. So no doubt the weather the past few days has been very enjoyable, but I definitely want to get out ahead of some changes I'm seeing. It just really kind of started to bubble up these changes over the past 24 hours. And what I'm seeing right now is a smaller system next week. Looks like it's going to develop, sit kind of offshore here, hoping to pull up monsoonal moisture, and then high pressure would bring in the heat next Wednesday. Wednesday and Thursday, that would be the best bet to get some thunderstorms in Northern California. Now, when you see this map here, you can see the highest risk of those monsoon thunderstorms would be over Southern California. Also the Sierra, about a half to one inch. We're just in that spotty chance range. But as we all know, any kind of thunderstorms could spark wildfires with our drought. So it's something we're going to be watching each and every day as we get closer. San Francisco temperatures warming up into the 70s widespread next Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. And yes, the heat, it's going to be on for us a little bit next week. I bumped those numbers up Monday through Thursday of next week, low to mid 90s. We may need to go a little bit hotter than that, uh, but uh, that's definitely a developing situation next week. So we hope those thunderstorms stay away, but uh, there's definitely a decent chance for us right now. Okay, thanks for the heads up. You got it.